hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to install c and c compiler on your windows 11 machine now compilers are used to convert the source code into machine readable code so that the computer can understand it now the compiler we are going to use is called gcc compiler so first head to your browser and then search for main gwc compiler and you can see the first page over here from sourceforge click on it now click on download and it should start downloading so you can see we've successfully downloaded the setup now close your browser and then double click on the setup to start the installation let's click on install now this is the directory it is going to install our c compiler so let's change this i want to install this on my ssd so just select the drive you want to install this so once you select the drive you click on continue so the installer is going to automatically download the required files for main gw to install on our windows machine this may take some time so you can wait The process has been completed. Now click on continue. Now there are three packages required for basic main GW setup. So we have to choose from here. The base package over here is for C program. Then the GCC G++ is for C++ program and the GCC object C is for objective C programming. So let's select the base program. Mark for installation select gcc g++ mark for installation this is for c this is for c++ and this is for objective c so we are going to select that as well mark for installation and then under installation up here click on apply changes click on apply now it will start downloading all the packages we selected So you can see the installation has been completed so let's close the installation manager close this now we have to check if it's installed or not so open command prompt on your system cmd and then type in this command version and you can see this is not recognized now the command prompt cannot detect the compiler because the environment path variable has not been set now head to your file manager we have to copy the part of the main gw bin so this pc this is the drive where i installed it so i will just click on the drive and then this is the bin so just copy the location copy now if we open command prompt and then specify the location which is bin now if we try to run that same command again g plus plus version you can see it is now working you can see over here copyright 2016 and every other information but now we have to make this available everywhere so you can run your program from anywhere so it can work on all the directories in your computer so let's close this now go to your search bar search for control panel and then on the search bar on your control panel search for system variables so you're going to see over here edit the system environment variable so click on that now it will take you here click on environment variables down here select the path so you can see the path over here and then click on edit now we have to set up a new path so click on new and then paste the path of your bin folder so this is the path for me depends on where you install yours and then hit ok now we can click on ok okay and then we can close this now we have to test this so let me go to my download folder now open your notepad and then type in this code now let's save us this is the folder we want to save it so let's call this hello dot c and then change the type to all files click on save so you can see our file has now been saved as hello.c 
now open your command prompt so this is our command prompt now specify the folder where you save the file so in this case i use the download folder so i will just type in cd downloads hit enter and it would move to this directory over here now to run our code type in gcc space hello dot c so once you write this gcc it would invoke the c compiler and then you can run any program you want to run so the compiled file will be saved in the same directory with the name a so you can see over here a and this is a compiled file this type of file would look like an application so to run the compiled file just write the name in your command prompt so you can see a over here so let's just write the name in our command prompt and you can see hello world has been printed so our c compiler has been successfully installed on our windows 11 pc now you can program in c c plus plus or objective c since we installed three of them so basically this is how to install c c plus plus and objective c compiler on your windows 11 machine if you have any questions then use the comment section if this video was beneficial to you please hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.